A man accused of murder after being deported eight times enters his plea just hours ago. And thanks for joining us here at 530. I'm Mike Dardis. And I'm Ashley Kirkland. We've been leading the way on this story for months now. Furman Garcia Gutierrez was accused of killing a 41 year old man in Butler County. WLWT News 5's Nicole Aponte is live in Hamilton tonight. Nicole, what happened in court? Hey Ashley and Mike, Garcia Gutierrez had a translator beside him today as he pleaded not guilty to the six counts a grand jury previously indicted him on. Two of those counts were for murder, another for aggravated assault, but we're learning tonight that it's not his first run in with the law. As Furman Garcia Gutierrez walked into his Raymond hearing Thursday, he was stoic. On behalf of Furman at this point, we had tendered not guilty plea on his behalf. As he pleaded not guilty to the six counts a grand jury indicted him on. Police say Garcia Gutierrez killed Fernando Oviedo back in April. The victim's body discovered in the garage where Gutierrez had been living on 13th Street in Hamilton. Last time he was in court, the officer who interrogated him revealed what exactly happened that day. He hit him with a, with a stick shovel type thing over the head and began to beat him up. Uh, hands, fists, kicks, tied him up. Gutierrez admitted to officers that he killed Oviedo after confronting him over the claim that Oviedo raped his girlfriend. The state of Ohio still trying to track down Oviedo's closest relative. The state has made efforts to find a next of kin for the deceased. We have still been unable to locate it. Gutierrez has been deported eight separate times before he illegally made his way back here to Hamilton. We learned today he's also been charged with four other counts separate from the murder case. And Mr. Garcia Gutierrez had multiple law enforcement contacts in a short period of time that I believe shows a risk to the community. We found out what that other case was. A grand jury indicted him on four other accounts. One of those counts was for aggravated possession of drugs. Another, using weapons while intoxicated. It was dated on April 17th, which just a few weeks after he allegedly killed Oviedo. Live in Hamilton, Nicola Ponte, WWT News 5. Nicole, was a bond set for Garcia Gutierrez? Yes, there was a bond set today. It's at $5 million. He is due back in court on August 15th at 1 p.m. for a pretrial hearing. Nicole Ponte live for us tonight. Thanks so much, Nicole. All right, right.